Peace to everybody. Um, as you know, this is October 1st, and of course, it's also October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Um, a lot of women are diagnosed with breast cancer. Some do make it, and um, some don't. And it's really sad that um, that the women who did not survive breast cancer either is because you know a lot of times breast cancer is not caught early enough but the women who are survivors they they do catch catch the cancer early so this way that the women can survive a lot longer and beat cancer one in eight women in the united states will be diagnosed with breast cancer in her lifetime is the most commonly diagnosed cancer in women and the second leading cause of cancer death among women. So there's one in eight chance of a woman in the United States will be diagnosed with breast cancer in her lifetime. And it's really sad that um, there's no cure for cancer unless you ca catch it early. Um, it is the most commonly diagnosed cancer in women and the second leading cause of cancer death among women and as you can see here is the pink ribbon for the cancer awareness month death rates for breast cancer have been declining since 1990 due in part to better screening and early diagnosis increased awareness and approved treatment options the American Cancer Society recommends women begin screening mammography at age 40. Women who have a family history of breast cancer or who are known to have high risk factors for breast cancer should discuss earlier screening with their physician. So the breast cancer has been declining since 1990. Um, and of course, you know, it's not an easy thing to go through, and it's really sad um, that things are not what you think they are, but it is, um, and it's also due to doing part to better screening and early diagnosis. So if you are over the age of 40, please get checked, because this is very important that, that the breast exams will tell you if you have it or not because there's no way of knowing by yourself without knowing <clears throat> peninsula imaging has 3d mammography machines considered the gold standard in breast cancer screening this enables quick scheduling of appointments while Reducing exam wait time for your convenience. Evening appointments are available. If you had your previous mammogram at another facility, we can early, easily, I'm sorry, obtain your previous results for a comparison. Radiologists as well as a clinical breast navigator are on site and available for consultation. So there's a Peninsula Imaging, and it has a 3D mammography machines. Um, it's considered to be the gold standard in breast cancer screening. This enables quick scheduling of appointments will, while reducing exam wait times. So it, it is cut down on some of the wait time. Um, for your convenience, evening appointments are available. If you had your previous mammogram at another facility, we can up or easily obtain your previous results for comparison. So this, so if you had it done at another facility somewhere, they could compare it with that facility. Um, radiologists, as well as a clinical breast navigator, are on site and available for consultation. As the area's leader imaging, we offer a full line of breast care services in addition to mammograms, including breast ultrasound and 3T breast MRI. So that's what they can offer is a breast ultrasound and a 3T breast 
MRI. So if you are going to make that appointment, please do so because it's very important that um, Breast Cancer Awareness Month means a lot for October. And, you know, it's not easy to deal with these, but, you know, but you have to please keep yourself healthy as much as you can. Please take care of your breasts because, you know, cancer is nothing to play with. And I understand there's no cure for it at all. So please do take care of yourself while you can. Leave your comments below. I am out.